Hello friends, I welcome you in lecture number 1 on relations. In this lecture, we are going to define binary relations or simply relations. So, suppose we have two sets, say set A and set B. Then we are familiar with the definition of Cartesian product of two sets A and B. A cross B is called Cartesian product of sets A and B and is defined as order pair AB such that first element comes from the first set and second element comes from the second set B. This is called Cartesian product of sets A and B. Now to define relation we must be familiar with this definition Cartesian product of sets A and B. Now relation is denoted by capital R and a relation from set A to B is defined as subset of this Cartesian product. Any subset of Cartesian product A cross B is called a relation from set A to set B. So, if we denote relation by capital R, then R is a subset of A cross B. Relation from set A to set B is nothing but subset of the Cartesian product A cross B. For example, suppose set A has two elements, say 1 and 2, and set B has say three elements a b and c then uh, we can write cartesian product a cross b suppose we fix one and vary these elements then we have one comma a one comma b one comma c similarly we can write two comma a two comma b two comma c this is nothing but Cartesian product of A cross B. Now we can define relation from A to B as any subset of A cross B. Suppose I consider these elements from A cross B, say 1A, 2A and uh, say 2B. Then this is subset of A cross B. So this is a relation from A to B. Any subset of A cross B is called relation. Suppose we denote this by R1, then we can define another relation from A to B. We consider another subset. Suppose I consider 1 comma C, 2 comma B and 2 comma C. Then R2 is also a subset of A cross B. Therefore, R2 is a relation from A to B. So, whenever we have a relation from one set to another set, then we can see that it is a set of ordered pairs, where first element comes from the first set, second element comes from the second set. So, relation is uh, considered as a set of ordered pairs or simply any subset of A cross B is called relation from set A to set B. Now here uh, suppose I consider this element then this element is a member of this relation R1 so that we can write as 1 comma A belongs to R1. This means 1 comma A ordered pair is an element of relation R1. Another way of writing this is 1 is related to element A by relation R1. So, we write 1 R1 A and uh, here we can see that this element 1 C is not in R1. So, this we can rewrite as 1 R1 C and because 1 is not related to C by R1, we will consider this type of line on R1. 1 is not related to C by R1. And here 1 is related to A by R1. Similarly, here 2B is a member of R2. 
so we can write this as 2 is related to b via relation r2 so this is simple definition of relation uh, it is uh, called binary relation from a to b but generally we are not speaking binary relation we consider uh, it as relation from a to b but actual definition is it is binary relation so here i have written this definition let a and b b sets a binary relation from a to b is any subset of a cross b and as i discussed binary relation from a to b is a set of ordered pairs where the first element of each ordered pair comes from set a and the second element comes from set b and if we want to write down that ordered pair ab belongs to r then that we can denote by this notation also a is related to b and if a is not related to b uh, we will use this notation and uh, this is meaning of this uh, notation ab belongs to r that means a is said to be related to b by the relation r this is another example suppose i have this set a having three elements and b is having two letters then if we can see this 0 comma a 0 comma b 1 comma a 2 comma b is a relation from a to b because here first elements comes from set a and second elements comes from set b therefore this is going to be a subset of cartesian product a cross b cartesian product a cross b is nothing but order pair a b where a belongs to first set b belongs to second set so whenever we consider the elements of this type where first element comes from first set second element comes from second set then the set of those ordered pairs is always subset of a cross b therefore this is a relation from a to b and here we can see 0 comma a is member of this relation which we denote by capital r therefore we can write that 0 is related to a and 1 comma b is not in the relation r therefore we will use this notation 1 is not related to b and uh, we can represent relations graphically also here i have represented this relation graphically as well as by table here 0 is related to a as well as b so on this side i have written members of set a 0 1 2 here members of set b a and b and here it is uh, 0 is related to a and 0 is related to b therefore there are two arrows from 0 towards a and b and 1 is related to a 2 is related to b so 1 goes to a 2 goes to b similarly we can use table also here i have written members of set a these are the members of set b and if 0 is related to a we will make this type of cross mark if element of set a is related to element of set b we will consider this type of cross mark and uh, in other uh, situation we will not write anything so 0 is related to a so there is one cross mark here 0 is related to b also so here one cross mark 1 is related to a so one cross mark 1 is not related to b so this this is blank similarly 2 is not related to a so this is kept blank and 2 is related to b so this is the uh, graphical representation of relations and uh, uh, we have seen that if we have two sets a and b then we can talk about their cartesian product and any subset of cartesian product is called relation from a to b 
so this is the simple meaning of relation and uh, we will continue with this series in upcoming lectures thanks for watching